love it <laughs> tailor to everybody that buys it the brand and the bible verse have a list of what you what you must have in an apartment i understand if you're worried about the person's ability to pay for your pocket mm -mm. the money in your pocket <laughs> So welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Isabella Awan. I'm a product specialist and a YouTuber based in Lagos, Nigeria. If you're a returning subscriber, welcome back to my channel. But if this is the first time of watching any of my videos or you're just here to subscribe to my channel, what are you waiting for? Please go ahead, click on the red subscribe button. Thereafter, hit on the notification bell just beside the red subscribe button so that you can be amongst the first to get a notification of my video whenever I drop them. Buddies, I am super excited today because I have my first guest in the house. Hi, hey, beautiful guest. Hello. How are you doing today? I'm very well, thank you. Oh, yeah, guests, guests, <laughs> um, introduce yourself. Tell my viewers who you are, what you do, and yeah, how they can reach reach out to you. Oh, hi guys. My name is Salami Mubala Jiajake. I'm a talent acquisition specialist uh, in very lame and simple language. I'm Asia. <laughs> Asia. 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 <laughs> I am Asia. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, great. Um, Ajoka, do you do any other thing apart from like HR? I know you have a brand. You don't want to talk about mm -hmm. your brand. Why yeah. my friends like yeah. this? Okay, so yes. Okay, 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 okay. You don't catch it. <laughs> I do have a brand. Oh. And my brand name is Tenor. <laughs> we have it on set. Yeah. My brand name is Tenor. Yeah. And and um, one of the most inter interesting part of, um, of my brand is that um, the name is particularly very personal now to me. The, the full meaning of Tenor is Ulua Tenor Ayomi, the Lord pathway for my goodness, um, for my joy. And then every brand, every piece of my candle has a Bible verse attached to it. So it is particularly tailored to everybody that buys Ooh. it, the brand and um, the Bible verse and the, um, uh, the scent that, that is accompanied with it. Yes. Apart mm -hmm. from my candles, I do also have um, stickers, faith, I have faith um, inspired um, good stickers, jotters, and um, Bible tabs, basically, yes. So, uh, at Shop Codos on IG. Yeah, I would put <laughs> their IG handle on the screen. Yeah. So, yeah, Ajoke, um, I'm super excited to have you here. And guess what? You're actually my first guest. Ooh. So, I'm thinking, I don't even have a name for this yet. <laughs> Probably, I would call it on the couch with Bella okay. for my guests. But let's let's see how that goes. Exactly. So, today, um, we will be talking about something very interesting. Uh, my channel, I talk about adults living different aspects. Anything, as long as you have to do it as an adult. I, so, my the topics are not limited. So today's topic is going to be about house hunting. You know that when we are growing up, we are like, oh, when I can't wait to grow up to leave the house, I'm going to live in my own house oh and do God. everything. So yeah, and I know that recently you got an apartment. You guys, Ajoke's apartment is nice. Ajoke's apartment is so I'm cute. I'm shy. I'm shy. <laughs> so yeah, I just want to understand your experience um, regarding um, apartment hunt, house hunting in Lagos and so you can share with people in case you are in your parents house and you're planning to come outside you should know what you should prepare for <laughs> or you are already in a house and you're vexing you're, you're currently with your landlord and you're now doing shakara I'm going to back out of this compound just know that this is what you should prepare yourself for so first of all I'll start with um what are like some of the things you like the first things you think about when you want to rent an apartment first thing you think about when you want to get an apartment for me environment first thing first environment mm -hmm. how secure the environment is and the history of the environment basically you hear when you tell somebody you're staying in mushi the first thing that comes to your mind is what how can you go and stay in Mushi? But then again we have places in Mushi that are secured right I mm -hmm. have friends that stay in Mushi I have friends that stay in Ajegune, you know, really. Yeah. Yes, the history of the environment. But first thing that comes to my mind when I talk about when I think of looking for an apartment mm -hmm. is the environment. Yeah. And second thing 
is the house itself. Okay. The tall thing is the landlord. Okay. I, 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 it's a personal thing. I, I can't stay in, the, in a house where the landlord, the landlord stays. Staying. Okay. It is not because uh, it's, it's, it's just has a thing to it. I like to have ownership of where I am. Mm -hmm. You have given me the apartment. I've, you have rented the apartment. Okay. If I need anything, yeah, yeah, I reach out to you. You don't have to double it. Oh. You people have to share. You don't have to share us. Yeah, don't worry. Yeah. We'll, we'll be we'll fine. We are grown up adults. Adults. Yeah. So and again, um, let's also forget that the budget is very important. Mm. Your pocket, mm -mm. the money in your pocket mm. is very, very important. Yeah, it yeah. is. So your budget and yeah, like I said, environment. Um, um, the house itself, what the yeah. house looks like, and um, the aesthetics of the house because I'm, I'm very aesthetic. Uh, the aesthetics of the house, yeah. your budget, and then um, the landlord. Yeah. Uh, how nice the landlord is. If the landlord stays in the house, mm -hmm. if from the first time I speak to a land a house owner, I can tell if I'm going to stay in the house or not. We are going to come back to this house owner conversation, having a conversation with the house owner. But first of all, let me ask: Is this the first time your apartment hunting in Lagos? No, this is not the first time. Um, in Lagos, this yeah. is the second time. The second time. Yeah. So I'm sure you have, ex like, the experience was different. Yeah, it was different. Can you tell me something that was a bit different with this experience? For my first search, I was not particular about anything. I didn't have any okay. choice. But the second one, I, I had a list of things I was checkboxing. Let's you know, let's like, go through that <laughs> list a bit. <laughs> Can we go through that list? So, so you, I'm sure you had location, definitely. Yes. Um, the second thing is probably which your budget you will have to consider is it one bed you're looking for is it self con is it two bedroom did you think about that or you were flexible with that i was not flexible you i was okay. not i was certain that i did and I, I i wanted a a two bedroom or a room and parlor is it okay. a two bedroom or a room and parlor nothing that's nothing. a mini flat yes, room a mini and flat. yes thank okay, you yeah. sorry <laughs> a mini flat yeah. or a two bed it's is that or nothing so you also mentioned the walls so it must be something you're not going to have to screed again yes like it's not something i don't have to screed or i don't have to repaint oh yeah. so you were also like so because I know some new apartments in Lagos, they don't paint. Like my they, current apartment, they didn't paint. They only screened it, and that was fine. Okay, that was fine. So you painted the color just, you yeah, wanted. Okay. Um, did you also think about lighting? I know you create videos inside your house from time to time. Did you say, oh, no? Did you ever go to any apartment and you say, no, this apartment is too dark? Funny, it's not airy. funny enough, I think I was just lucky. I had never, I didn't put that in my budget. So immediately I saw my current apartment. Immediately I saw it. I just knew that. Yeah, that's you, that's you, that's you right there. Nice. So I, did, I didn't have um, lighting in my... In my mm, okay. I did, the only thing I think I had that was close to that was ventilation. Yeah, because I think ventilation is a combination of natural... So when I say lighting, I you meant mean natural, natural light. light. Oh, natural light, yes. Yeah, I, yeah. I put that in, in Natural yeah, light, yes, yeah. Yes. At least, Palo must have, like, two windows, yes. things like yes, that. Yes, yes, I do. Okay, uh, what else did you... You, you mentioned kitchen cabinets. So I mentioned... I mentioned kitchen cabinet, but I'm also particular about the size of the kitchen because the kitchen, the, my former house, the kitchen cannot contain two cubicle. Of, yeah, cubicle <laughs> cannot contain yeah. two of us. Yeah. So I was very particular because I also like cooking. So mm -hmm. I think my my kitchen restricted me from cooking as much as I wanted, mm. right? So most times, I'd rather cook late in the night when I know that, oh, I'm just, I, I'm I not know, disturbing yeah, anything. Yeah. I'm not disturbing yeah. anybody. Nobody's in my house. I have to, yeah. So I was very particular that I wanted a kitchen that is a bit... Um, Spacious, right? Okay. That I can move about in it, and yeah. I can contain some of my plenty load that my mm -hmm. grandma sends to me. <laughs> you know, that's nice. Yeah, that's so nice. Kitchen, ventilation, and um, the walls. The walls. The yeah. size of the, the size parlor and bathroom. Thank you. The size of the parlor. Were you bathroom. particular about wardrobe? Because I was particular about wardrobe. My, like I don't want to go and be buying wardrobe outside. I needed inbuilt. So for the first, if you're searching for apartment in Lagos. <laughs> Look at me now. If you have a bro, a Obodo in Bo list standard, <laughs> it will shock you. <laughs> You'll be shocked. Because you will reduce that list a little yeah. by little. So yeah. for the first uh, few um, time when I was like, for the first few weeks or mm -hmm. month when I was looking for apartment, I had that in my list. Yeah. But then I found out that houses that have um, inbuilt um, wardrobes, wardrobes yeah. is it that they are old houses? Mm, okay. okay. Or the ones that even have. Um, What's it called in it? Wardrobe in it that new houses that have wardrobe yeah. that are a bit expensive, more expensive than my okay. than my pockets, right? Yeah. So I, I started to think about it that okay, maybe I have to remove that one. I think mm -hmm. they maybe if they don't have wardrobe, maybe they will mm, rest. Maybe yeah. I'll come I'll go and buy it. You can buy I can buy wardrobe okay. later. I can even leave my clothes in my 
Okay. In my uh, in my traveling bag, I'll be picking it on after the order. Okay. And when I'm ready, I'm ready. So yeah, I had that, but I took it out because mm, it was okay. not uh, it was not something that is more rampant in Nigeria than now for them. To, we are getting there. Like I'm yeah. seeing new houses, and they always have wardrobe in it. I think most of the new houses, the wardrobe are even like external. External, yes, yeah, so they yeah. can take it out. Exactly. Yeah, but the ones that have inbuilt wardrobe, they are old, old houses. houses, and they're always very big. Yeah. But you have to, ref you have to renovate and do a lot of things. Yeah, I agree. I think um, same thing with my my current apartment when we are shooting this video, having built wardrobe, but I just had to do a lot of things like change the floors mm. and like all those things. So yeah, I, I hear you. I hear you. Were you particular about the floor? Because I've, I don't know where some, I don't know if I should call them developers used to carry towels from. Those ugly, have you seen those ugly ass towels? My sister. <laughs> don't know that way. When I was searching for apartments, <laughs> they would take me to some apartments. I would not even enter. You'd be like, let's be going back. I said, don't worry. Don't worry. I know I will not take it. Don't let's go down. back. Or even if I bring out my phone, they yeah. you know the amount of pictures that they sent to me. Oh, wow. I'm, I'm, my friends will be watching the video, so they, they, yeah. they can't they can see Definitely. At the point, they got tired of sending me out to people. <laughs> you know, like, I open and say, no. no. I will not even finish with that. Yeah. No. Yeah. Yes, I'm so particular about the tiles I'm particular about I'm particular about literally almost everything, everything. And like I said I am aesthetic curious yeah. and conscious sorry and I am also particular about the things that I don't have to spend extra, extra money, money for it to be fit yeah. what I want I don't want to do so much yeah. Right, yeah so I think the summary of the lesson here is um have a list of what you what you must have in an apartment but when you start the hunt know that you might start Taking it Taking out. Taking some things out, bit. but still know that there are some things that are like a standard. If those things are not okay, so there, you I can think I should say yeah. standard is yeah. water. Meter is shaky, but meter is important. Yeah. Environment. Yeah. The mm -hmm. um, environment is where the house yeah. is located. And the kind of um, renovation you have to do in the have house, to do, yeah. basically. That's okay. like most powerful oh, thing yeah. because that will, that will be also, something that I think I didn't think of when I was looking for my apartment, but now that I'm here and I decided to think about it, yeah. is where your own apartment is. Hmm. I realize that where my apartment is, people now, they, they pack their car just down. So I wake up very early. When people are going to, I work from home. So people mm -hmm. are going to work, I'm waking up with them because as they're entering their car, everybody's over. The run, noise. Run, run. Oh. noise. Oh, yeah. Talking about that, I know a friend of mine that got an apartment, and unfortunately, her apartment window, her bedroom window was close to where the generator house is. That's sad. She just couldn't sleep. That's she sad. just couldn't sleep. That's, That's the summary. That's like you, you cannot tell your neighbors not to want you now. Like, like you can't. You can't should do... I tell them not to park their cars? <laughs> like you can. So yeah, you, you need, need to start up the car. Yeah. I'm up and I'm like, Shh, yeah. Sh, sh, sh. I should have to... taken upstairs. Yeah. I started to think about it. That upstairs. I should have taken yeah. upstairs. But I didn't think about it at that time. I just like the space in my house. I like yeah. It. Yeah. I think I think that also makes sense. Mm -hmm. Where your apartment is like in the compound. Yeah. Okay. Great. I think that makes sense. Now let. Let's go back to like the two stakeholders that <laughs> that are involved in this apartment hunt. The first one, which they might, it's they don't really have problem most. Well, they have problem, but not every time. The landlord, because I know the main people that have problem is agents. We will come to the agents. Let's talk, <laughs> let's talk about landlord. So you mentioned that you don't want to stay in an apartment where um, the landlord lives. Have you had bad experience with that? I I don't I, I don't I don't I don't think I've particularly stayed in a house where landlord is. Perhaps my friends have stayed oh, in yeah, a house okay. where landlord is. In fact, I'm sorry that I have to say this, my <laughs> love, but I need to share it. Out. <laughs> I, I knew one day she told me that yeah. a landlord called, you know, dropped a message on the group and said that why 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 did they put um, that he wants to wash clothes and now that he saw that there's clothes all over the lines. Oh. That now from today ends forth. They should take rope to work. Yeah, no, that is is counting now. One, two, three, four rope from the beginning it's of those lines is his line. That nobody should put clothes on it. The ones behind that they can be using. So in the days where you are washing six hundred and thirty nine clothes, landlord's rope cannot be touched. So I think that mostly one of my concerns with and again the whole idea of if I have a car I want to move back into the house, I have to go and meet the landlord, I have to do this, I have to do that. It's just a lot. 
and this or oh, something spoils in their house, mm. you can't fix it until you talk to the landlord. Oh, oh that's horrible. Oh. Because you can't touch anything because the landlord stays there. Oh. Imagine that it's just two people. You will fix it and they probably call the landlord and oh, yeah. say, oh, we did this, we did that, we did that. But when the landlord is there, you cannot touch, because you are touching the light, you are touching mm -hmm. his apartment. Yeah. If you are touching the water, you are touching his apartment, it will affect him. So yeah. you have to still talk to him. Okay. Yeah, so. well, that, that makes sense. I used to be a bit open to staying with landlords but i have heard people give like a lot of terrible stories i know a friend that the landlord came to complain that there are too many women visiting him i'm like it's it's a bit oh, too do much do you also know I'm, I'm sorry if i'm going to be a little bit spiritual yeah. and, and churchy i'm a church girl sorry do you also know that landlords write it in their um what's, what's that thing that the contract agreement agreement yeah that kind of fellowship you're joking? No, I actually no. We can put it in a. We can. I can screenshot and show you people in this video. You can't have fellowship. You can't have fellowship. So, it, 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 did he specifically he say specifically wrote fellowship? You cannot have fellowship. But you can have parties. Yes. Ah. Uh, oh. Can so I? you allow parties, but you don't allow fellowship. Yes. Is that is dog and fellowship that you cannot have? Oh, do can't have pets. You can't have pets. Can't have pets at all. There is. There's something, something fishy. There's something fishy. It's not, it's not normal. <laughs> um, just before we move on from landlords, because I know I actually experienced this one in Lagos. You might not experience it, but this whole, you have to have conversation with landlord. When I was searching for apartment, this particular apartment I'm staying, I know that um, one thing that was really common was when I go to have conversation with landlords, you start hearing ridiculous expectations from landlord, like you must be Yoruba. Oh, I don't want single girl or married girl. And um, which one again? Christian or Muslim? You must be working class. And then you realize that no, he did not just mean working class. You cannot do work from home. To, because uh, you don't. They don't. Work, yeah, you're not from working. Work from home. You're not doing any job now. They don't <laughs> think you're working. So what, uh, is there any other like ridiculous? Yeah, they, there are ridiculous. They, yeah. yeah but when when I went to see uh, my the lawyer that they gave yeah. me because I didn't meet the yeah. owner of the house itself. The kind of things that she asked me was, where do I work? Yeah. I told them, uh, how many people are going to be staying in the house with me? Mm -hmm. I told her, am I going to get married in the house? I told her, why not? No, I, I'm not. Why like, should I, I my house, not supposed to come and move into my house, please? I said, no. And let me tell you something, Texas and tech bro. <laughs> if they ask you, where do you work? You are going to mention uh, one uh, fintech. <laughs> or web developer. <laughs> they don't recognize it. <laughs> yeah, don't... yeah, oh boy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> you, you are not a lawyer. You are not a doctor. You are not a banker. You are not doing I any don't, job. I don't stress myself. I just saw them on the accountant. Are you going to explain? Even I, yeah. me, what I told her is I said, I said, I work in the bank. She said, oh. <laughs> Even though I said I work in the bank, at at home, she was like, oh, oh yes. Yeah. yes. And then they will ask you, are you, would you be able to pay for the next trend? I found that, mm. I found mm. that, yeah, I found mm. that demeaning at, the, at first, but then mm. I understand where she was coming from. She's like, am I the one that will be paying for the next trend? I'm like, mm. yes. So, yeah. Are you, no, that's, that's not the question to ask. Mm. Like, I understand if you're worried about the person's ability to pay for the next rent. That makes sense. But why are you asking, I you the She just one? wants to be sure, since I said that I'm in a relationship. Oh, so in case the relationship breaks and you don't, and now no, I'm maybe the one that rented. I don't even. Eh, eh, I don't even want to. Oh, not yeah. sure if I'm the one that rented this one. In fact, and in the beginning of our conversation again, during this period I was searching for house, I was not mm. really myself. I got really yeah, young. yeah. So I'm sure that the heart seeing me and the mm -hmm. desperation in my voice, you're probably thinking, this girl cannot afford this house. Somebody has rented the house for, but it's okay. Let's just let me hear from you. Are you will you, you, you be the one that lucky like girls have spoiled market? It's so them now. It's them that spoil market. Them. So I think after I told, but it's I, understandable. Yeah, too. I literally had to tell her how much I earn per uh, month, and then she okay. was like, "Yeah, I had to tell her because yeah. I wanted her to get more comfortable." Yeah. I had to tell her how much I earn. She was like, "Oh, she didn't mean it." I said. I know that you did not, yeah. but I want you to get very comfortable to be mm. sure that uh, nah, I'll we'll pay, we'll pay, I'll pay your money. Okay, so very random question tied to that. I know you schooled outside Nigeria. When you were getting an apartment, I don't know how the apartment structure was. I know outside Nigeria, because I have friends in UK, you feel from 
um, do they also ask where do you work and yeah, how do. much you earn? Yeah, they do. Okay, that makes sense. They do. Then. They, yeah. I, I, think it, I think theirs is not even very as tedious as ours because they have a database, so it's not that oh, difficult. Oh, okay. Yeah, they have a database. Yeah. Uh, you know what I'm asking? When I go into real estate, I'm actually going to have a form. Like, if you want to stay in my house, if you're interested in the house, you fill the form and submit, I'll screen you. And I, did, I did police you, profiling. Yeah, yeah. I'll so send, my house, I did I'll, police profiling. I'll send you regret mail. I'm sorry, unfortunately, because of this or that, we cannot quit. All right, uh, Majoka, thank you very much for sharing this experience. Let's now talk about the cocoa of the house hunting. <laughs> hey, see, Lagos agents the, would make you The main go men, mad. the main men. Okay. They would make you go mad. Yes. So um, what was your experience or when you were looking for agents, what was your approach? Let's start from there. Okay, so the first mistake I made was go back to the guy that got me my phone house. <laughs> <laughs> Never do that. Never do that. The first that. mistake I made was that. that. And See, finish up. Yes, thinking that, oh, now you got my house, so you know the kind of thing that I yeah. would want. But then again, I realized that, let me tell you something, so you know that I have no this agent for very long. <laughs> The agent of mainland is like Siri Mainland. Siri Mainland. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have Magodo Mainland. We yeah. have Yaba Shomolu. We yeah. have Yaba Shomolu Mainland. Siri Liri. kind of mainland. And then we have the rest that is going to Korodo and all the rest of it. Yeah. And then before we now have Island mm -hmm. agents. So don't go to Island agents. You are looking yeah. for house. And the house that you are looking for is on the mainland. Don't yeah. go there. Again, me, um, agents. So your agent must be someone who has houses in the areas you are looking exactly. for. So okay. how you would, and again, they will not tell you. How you can tell is tell them that you are looking for apartment. They ask you where sick bagada. Mm. And they send you a house, but I tell you you want to see it the next day. Mm. When he tells you that, oh, he wants to call the person that is in charge, just know that he's, yeah. not, he's, oh, okay. he's not in that area. Yeah. I now have a trustworthy agent that I can reach out to. Every location? I think I have for um, Ogudu, I like Pere Ketu access. I have the one that can show you the picture of the houses, but it doesn't have key to the place. <laughs> but I have a uh, shout out okay. to this guy Sunday. It was very, very helpful. Okay. But agents in general, they are, they are not very normal. <laughs> they are the agents of darkness people. I have paid when I was looking for an apartment. I got, I got quickly from this my house in November, yeah? Yeah. And so from that November to like the time I moved into my apartment, how many agents did you pay? I think I paid pay, I paid ten thousand. My first were Mary or um, five times, four or five times. That's just just for money. Yeah, it, it, is it not, from, they call it registration. It's registration. Yeah, registration. Now. Now. It not hard to. I mean that I used to do baby girl life. I want to take Uber to where I'm going uh, to. You know that you not enter Uber, you not get there. Yeah. You know the guy will not say. Well, let's go. They will not take a can of paper or card. I don't know how to see pay. Yes, 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 by the way. You pay the transportation for you inspection. And you are going, you are test, you buy what are you buy. Ah, oh, mother, you know why? You, you, give, you them. give them, yeah. But I think one major thing that I've learned from them mm -hmm. that I know for sure yeah. is that everything that they are trying to do is try to make money off you. Yeah. Yeah. Whether they take you to an apartment or not, you have to pay for that registration fee. Yes. Whether you find an apartment or not, you still have to pay. Whether you pay for an apartment or not, mm -hmm. whether you get the apartment or not, yeah. you have to pay for the yeah. registration fee. Whether you see the apartment or not, you pay. Yeah. If they even send you, the one that I say I have that I can send you pictures, pictures of six yeah. million apartments, he still asks me for money. Oh, yeah. All because he's sending me pictures. Pictures, yeah. They do that a lot. But you know what stresses me most about agents? Why? Is the lies that they tell. Oh, yeah, they, they lie so much. Let me tell you how it works. You get an, a notification <laughs> from agent and they say, um, n new. <laughs> Let's <laughs> talk about the way agents market house in Lagos. New, new. Newly built. Newly, newly built. Luxurious. Luxurious. One bedroom apartment, direct mandate. <laughs> the, the direct mandate is the first, so they direct mandate. When you see direct mandate, they go direct. Direct mandate. <laughs> Two bedroom luxurious apartment, apartment located in a secured in a secured environment. <laughs> Gated. I just sent Todd Milan Bridge. Personal personal prepaid meter. Personal prepaid meter. Space parking space. Two toilets. <laughs> Guest toilet and kinikon yeah. toilet. K 
Kini Kong, Kini Kong, semi furnish. Semi furnish. And semi, they now write. Semi furnish is only <laughs> cabinet, to cabinet in the in kitchen. kitchen. In that semi furnish. They will now write, um, <laughs> let me say, 2.6 million. Rent annually, 2.6 million. million. Service charge, 20%. Um, Lega and commission, 20 20%. 20%. Each. What's that other one? Caution fee. Caution fee. They can even put 10% in down. Yes, and uh, 10%. Yeah. But now say, slightly negotiable. <laughs> that thing kills me. Every when I single that slightly... word, there is a lie. Yeah. Every single... These guys, I don't even... I never understand them. I think, I think mostly, like I said, because I had to pay two agents for my apartment. Two of them showed me their mm. apartment. One of them took me there. Yeah. But because the other one actually, you know, Send the picture to me. I had to see you give them money. What I've learned, what happened to me is that my the lawyer didn't give out their house, mm. but they heard about the house, so they were looking for people for their lawyer. So she took the money, agency money, and her agreement. She collected the money. Who the, the lawyer? lawyer? She wasn't going to give any agent. So what they did, why they usually will say twenty percent, is because the law, the person that owns the house will collect agency. They have to also collect their part because they did part of the yeah. job. person is not going to give. So what I found out is after I paid my lawyer, the agents came came asking. Uh, I didn't give them their share. I, I'm like, I don't have business with you. I already pay agency ten percent, ten percent, ten percent. Why do I have to come and say the woman did not give them anything? That she only gave. They might also be lying. They're lying. So I said she only gave them fifty thousand naira. Mm. I'm like, oh okay, fifty k is not enough. But I still have to give them the number. Don't worry, I'm, I'm that nice. Yeah. I still have to give them, I think I gave them like 30K, right? And the reason why I gave them that money is not because of nice, because they, you'll be loyal to me in the nearest yeah. future. So yeah. that you can show my Yeah, you create that relationship, yeah. yeah. so I think most time, the reason why they do that 20% is because most of the houses is not their direct connect. They have to also reach out to somebody and they have to cut their own, um, they have to get their own cut from the percentage that the person is collecting, so. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Great. Um. That makes sense. Is there anything you would tell people to be very careful of when they are renting apartments in Lagos? Like, what are the things they should look out for? One thing I would say I will not do is this: you pay money and then the house will be completed in two months or three months. No, I, I, I can't. I can't advise my enemy because I need you to settle down so that we can quarrel. I, where I think. I think one of the one of the one of the things that when I was looking for apartment, I saw one apartment. Um, let me not give them advice. I was somewhere in one estate like that. Yeah. And then I, I really liked it. Funny thing, I wanted to stay in Ubudu. I really okay. wanted to stay in Ubudu. So I really liked the apartment. And I'm, saying, I'm like, oh, this is what I want. And at that time, they were still, they, that finished inside. They were still doing the outside. outside okay. So the guy told me that, oh, this place will not be ready in three months. Will not be ready in three months. What was left? They didn't do piping. They, they didn't, done everything. Was, even Water wiring. Was running the, so I think the only the thing was, that was you know, that was running is the um, the wiring, okay. the, the meter. He said that the meter will take like three months before yeah, it gets yeah, here. Yeah. And I totally understand. Like that. That's from UKJ. Yeah, Electric, I totally yeah. understand. But one thing that I did not get was the fact that he like literally told me three months. Did you ask why? I asked him and he said because he doesn't want to put anybody in the house and they'll start complaining. That's like the most trustworthy person I've met oh, in this wow. life. But guess what? Let's take it to other people. Do you say this house, madam, you don't even finish two weeks now. Madam, you see this block with the put here now. Person they even pack come in tomorrow. Madam, ma see this house now. Person I get the door, they go see enter now. <laughs> if you don't pack come out now, person another thing that I'll say, madam, if you don't answer now, person won't pay. Is a line nobody. Uh, uh, yeah, they will say, oh, person they even come in. Oh yeah, this Ooh, guy is lying. They lie. So I think the lesson there is don't let them pressure you. Exactly. Don't, don't let them make you feel And don't make decision. Again, Desperate sorry, oh, one, yeah. one last thing. Do not ever go to look for an apartment alone. Is it as a woman or as a... Anybody. Anybody, okay. And the reason is because there has to... Something that you cannot see, another person yeah. would see. It. Oh, yeah. Me, yeah. I, I felt like I. Before I, you pay for an apartment. Yeah, I felt like it was my personal see, yeah. thing, but I, I realized that it actually helped a lot. Yeah. Because making decision, the other person might think of the apartment or the area in a different mm -hmm. way. You see it in a different way. Yeah. And again, assume, assume yourself living in the house. Mm. When I got to my place, the first thing I thought about is I'd already scattered everything where yeah, my stuff yeah, are going yeah, to be yeah. and i thought about it do i see myself here yeah 
do I see myself in this house? If I do, we are good. Yes, I, I love that part of assume yourself living in the house because mm. I remember there was this, uh, talking about agents, there was this apartment that from the junction mm. to the apartment is like, the children of Israel mm. trekking from Egypt mm. <laughs> to the promised land. And then the the, the agent kept saying, Enough for again, we were so, we so rich. rich. Now, 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 like, 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 people, people I can't imagine kind. myself having to trick that trick every morning yes. to know it. How close is it to, yeah. to the basic things? To Markets, the basic things, WhatsApp, yeah. You need to food. also look out for that. Yeah, your work, your work. I, I didn't yeah. say work area because I don't, I don't uh, yeah, work, work from home. home. So, yeah. But if you go to the office every day, think of how you would leave the house. If you have to leave the house very early, is it safe enough for you to leave the house straight to where Electricity, you have to Electricity, sorry. I forgot to add. It's very important. Band A, band B. Band, band A, band B. Don't go important. to abandon. No, don't, <laughs> don't, go, don't, go, don't go to abandon. Choose either band A or band B. B yeah. But, um, Ajoke, yeah. thank you very much. I think this was really insightful. Yeah. I can imagine someone who is about to rent apartments in Lagos watching this video and saying, thank God for this video. Just think that. Take, like, take pen and paper and chart things. Just Things Just things now. now. Yeah, actually. Thank you very much. Just before we let you go, I have a game. Okay. And the game is um, Rapid This or That. So I'm going to ask you... Then get ten... to win something. <laughs> <laughs> I'm joking. Then get to win something. Okay. Um, yes, you get to okay. win something. Yes, All right. I'll, I'll owe you something. All right. So um, I'm going to ask you 10 questions. Funny thing, is not like they are hard questions. It's just about yourself. Okay. What okay. You, you would prefer. Um, I'll ask you 10 questions. So don't think too much. Three seconds, pay, drop answer. So 10 different questions. Are you ready? Born ready. First, first one, pizza or shawarma? Hmm. Pizza. Mm. Beaches or restaurants? What? Beach, like the beach. Or restaurant. Yeah, or I restaurant. Like beach. Beach. Yeah. yeah well, uh, we don't have beach in Lagos. <laughs> Movies or books? Movies. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Well, you're not a nerd. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to read. Uh, tea I'm or trying. coffee? Uh, coffee. Because tea, I will, I will pour the bolo in my mouth, the milk in my mouth. I'll and drink pour. water. It will make you so like a little bit of sugar. <laughs> so okay. Coffee. Okay, so coffee. Yeah. Um, chocolate flavor or strawberry flavor? Um, chocolate. I think strawberry is a scam. Yeah, I think it so just too. it smells nice, but it doesn't taste nice. So why? What are you giving me? You're yeah, mixing something else. It's not strawberry, damn it. See? Yeah. Um, early morning or late night? <laughs> <laughs> late night, please don't, don't wake me up in the morning. Oh yeah, I am. I am very clumsy. If you see my face in the morning, you think I am currently don't with wake you. me up in the morning. But I see in the night. Yeah. In the night, I'm, I'm very normal. Yeah, yeah I'll pray to yeah, it. Okay. Would you rather talk or write your feelings, your emotions? Talk I'd rather or write? talk about it. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so you talk. Yeah. Um, if you go on a vacation, would you want to do a more of relaxation or more of adventure? Ah, hey. <laughs> ah. <laughs> it's dice it. A, a little bit of both. Cause, no. Actually, thinking about the money now, the yeah. finance, I'm not going to go and be sleeping over there. Uh, when I can be sleeping adventure, now. Adventure, 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 adventure. Every day. I remember adventure. going to Bine and I had the snake thing. I went to the snake thing. Everyone oh. was like, oh my God. I'm like, that is what Try, I That's what I said for, yeah. yeah. But adventure. The reason I, I couldn't answer that question immediately is because I'm thinking, I can actually not get there and I say, you know, I just want to sleep. Uh, yeah. I can't even answer. You know, I just That's why I would love to go on vacation with people so that those people would ginger me. You, you know, you know that feeling that comes with, there's a thing I do. I want to rest. Uh, there's, a, there's a thing I actually do, not even back, but people will still call it yeah. vacation. In Lagos, I will rent an hotel and go and sleep there because I don't want to think about the plates in my yeah. kitchen, the floor that I need to mop. Yeah. I don't want to think about somebody knocking on my it's door. Very important. Yes, exactly. Okay, so. Adventure. Adventure. Okay. Um, this one, I think I know the answer. <laughs> Heels or flats? Ah, oh, it's flat. Yeah, it's I a flat. Yes, flat. Flat. No. Uh, the last one. Um, weeks or breeds? Ha! <laughs> <laughs> it's dicey. Very dicey. Uh, I don't know. Maybe somebody wants to send me wig now. Let me just say wig. 
<laughs> we get we okay i think that's all the question thank you very much for um coming to my couch with bella i don't know if that would be the name for it'd be nice yeah it's so nice having a guest for the first time on my channel thank you very much um till i see you next time on another episode of um, with bella don't forget to follow at joke mm. um I, I will put her handle on the screen and please buy candle see let me tell you, let me just tell you something about it, okay? <laughs> what is that candle? You see this candle? You have chocolate inside. <laughs> do you know, do you know the I first am, time you saw the, the candle, you were like... I almost, to I wanted to eat I it. it. <laughs> so, I didn't even burn it, but it smells nice. So, you guys, order from Tenno. Is this shop with Tenno, yeah, right? Yeah, shop with Tenno. Yeah, I'm going to put the handle in the description um, box below, and I'll put it on the handle. And please, when you buy from her, Tell her that you saw her, um, a, her page through here. So let me, maybe she'll start paying me for influencer market. I probably will think about it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right. Thank you very much, guys. Thank you so much. I'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. Bye.